so this is my little game that I've been making so far. At the moment, I've only got a zombie that uh, can that's got a pathfinding uh, element to it, so it can walk around objects to try and capture my player. Um, I wanted to add mobile controls to it, so I turned my app into uh, an Android app. So I went to build settings and just switched the platform to Android. Uh, the FPS controller worked great um, when it was a Windows app, but if I press play now, uh, there's no way of controlling it. I can't use WSA and D, I can't use my mouth to look. Uh, that's because it's... That's because it's no touch controls configured. So to do that, I just, to add the touch controls, I just went to Assets, Import Package, uh, and I got this cross-platform input. Uh, I think that was actually imported when I imported the characters. Um, and then I saw I've got this standard assets directory. Now this is, um, I just looked this up on the Unity documentation and it's really easy to add some touch controls. You just search for dual touch and then this prefab you just drag on uh, and this will work with the FPS controller just out of the box. If I press play now, uh, the, these are the bits of the area of the screen that the users will touch to move. Now, I've not got Unity Remote on here, uh, and because it's not on a phone it won't work, but basically this little, the left hand side moves the player around, and the right hand side moves the head around, just kind of like you'd expect from kind of any 3D game, and this automatically jumps. Uh, so that's quite simply how I added the controls uh, and the next bit is to to add a fire button I guess